Okay, and then next part is this timing chain removal and how it happens. There is really timing chain and it happens so easily that when we open these timing chain rails, we take these bolts, that bolt away in here, then these parts are loosened and remember that you have checked these top dead, dead center positions and now I open this bolt and also these two 10 mm bolts in here and actually they are 14, sorry 12 mm bolts okay and here I have this 12 mm bolt, I open this tensioner side firstly and note that now in this area there is specific bolt what belongs in here and these are steel frame and then in that second area there is two bolts, first one in here and it is short, look at how short bolt and similar in here and now this rail opens I take this bolt first and this is rail and remember that this is steel and this is this lubricant part and it goes only one way in here okay and now this chain is loosened and we can take this chain away firstly in this up area check that that they now now we can see that this timing chains and now I install this chain firstly in here and then we have to take out this down area and there is firstly this sensor feel that one and this opens nicely in here a little bit movement and if this is too tight I can use my this I can use my screwdriver carefully. There is my screwdriver and I very carefully I bend this in these sides. In that. And this is normally this part opens really easily, but now this is a little bit tighter and I, I use in this inner area and do not bend this feel because this is sensitive thing little by little, little, by little this part part opens Okay, now this feel is free and look there's small dent and F is like face that area and now I can take this next sprocket look this is important there's small sprocket we can look and there's small dent now we can look closely and this part opens so that I keep this chain and then only a little bit movement in outer also in that one carefully now this chain opens and then only this part and in this this engine these are 
really, really tight and there is no any extra tolerance in here. Okay, now, now this part is in here and this is down area and there is markings and it goes really in this way back. Okay, excellent thing. And now we can see that my timing chain is there in position I, and I can take this in this way away. And remember that these yellow markings they belong in here because these are timing marks. Okay, and now timing chain is free. And down area is okay. And there are there is my timing chain and these parts. And, uh, and now I install in here number 16 in this box.